10 hikes on 10 different trails and in 10 days. That is my newest short-term goal. Okay, so you guys know, of course, that I have a subscriber hike planned on September the 10th coming up uh, at Enchanted Rock State Park. And it is connected with charity. Uh, it is for the uh, American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, or the uh, AFSP. And of course, I joined the team, as you know, of Kyle, of Kyle Hates Hiking. I joined his team. Uh, which is connected with 46 Climbs, that organization that uh, donates to the AFSP. So I've been giving that information in my latest videos. Now, one thing that I realized, and just going back and, and looking at some of the information again, I didn't realize before was that you can do any number of trails or hikes or mountains, climbs, you know, as a part of this event that that goes from uh, the uh, from September 4th to September 13th. So they wanted you to pick a day is the way I understood it uh, in that 10-day uh, period and, and go do your hike and take a picture and send it to them. Well, reading more carefully the information, they said, you know, you can do as many as you'd like. So I've challenged myself to do a different hike on a different trail every single one of those 10 days. So let me show you my calendar and what I've got planned out to do. Okay, so the first day is going to be the 4th, and I'll be going on a local trail called Chalk Ridge Falls. Uh, it's not my favorite trail, but, uh, but I've got to come up with 10. So, so I'm going to be doing that one on the 4th. On the 5th is Dana Peak. That's also uh, a local trail that's out there at uh, Stillhouse Lake. And, uh, of course, it's called a peak, but around here are hills. We call them mountains. I've never been out there to hike, and uh, so don't think there's a lot of shit. The 6th is Miller Springs. Y'all are familiar with that. I'm out there all the time. Uh, I will go out there after morning worship. That's on a Sunday. Then on the 7th, Labor Day, uh, I'm going to go to, I'm just going to hike to downtown Belton uh, from the house uh, down to the creek, Nolan Creek. Going down there and then back will be five miles. And there'll be a lot of people down there on Labor Day at the creek. Then on the 8th is, the, is Colorado Bend. Now, uh, that's a state park. I've been there before with the family. We camped. Uh, but you'll have to, if you're interested in going, you'll have to get a reservation uh, online, and I'll put a link to that particular park. And my show-up time that I chose, my entry time, is 6 a.m. to 2 p.m. Uh, I want to do, I think it's called Gorham Falls. That's the main trail I want to do, but uh, I, I, I want to do more than that, hopefully. Uh, then another state park, Mother Neff, and it's pretty close to us here, not too far. Been out there a couple times before, did... Uh, uh, a, a subscriber hike out there but once again you're gonna have it's a state park so you're gonna have to get a permit my show up time my entry time is 8 a.m. to 4 30 p.m. so if you'd like to go on that one uh, go get registered then of course y'all know about Enchanted Rock I've uh, been giving out information on that then on the 11th is the Goodwater Loop Trail uh, and that is, it's not a state park. They usually don't charge if you're going to just go day hiking when you get to the gate and let them know. Uh, but it's in the Cedar Breaks Park there at Georgetown Lake in Georgetown, Texas. So I'll give more information about these trails and, and when I plan on showing up and stuff like that. And then on the 12th, uh, the Dinosaur Valley State Park. I'm, uh, I've never been there before, so I'm particularly looking forward to that one. So you're going to need, it's as a state park, you're going to need to make your reservation. Uh, and my entry time I chose is 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. And I've never been there. Uh, I'm going to have to probably watch uh, Cameron, Cameron's videos. He uh, lives close to there, and I think he's ha has videos 
of some of the trails out there. That's uh, ultralight outside. So I'm going to have to go watch his videos and maybe see what I <laughs> what trails I want to go on there. And then uh, the, the final day on the 13th will be Eagle Mountain Lake Trail, Eagle Mountain Lake Park. Uh, that is uh, up there in Fort Worth near where my brother Gary and his family live. But that'll that's on a Sunday, so I'll worship with them uh, and uh, that morning have lunch, I'm sure, and then head out and do that do that hike. So anyway, that's uh, 10 different trails, uh, 10 different hikes, 10, 10 different days. And it's going to be challenging for me because I don't hike big miles, you know, five miles or so uh, is right now, it's really pushing it for me. And, um, you know, and I don't do it every single day. Well, I'm going to be hiking fairly big miles on many of these days. And, uh, and then, of course, after long drives on uh, a few occasions, uh, this isn't going to be easy. It is definitely going to be a challenge. So I'm going to put this information down below, the dates, the trails, uh, the times as I know them now, especially of the ones that, uh, uh, you know, for reservations, uh, the ones that I picked, uh, the, the entry times on the reservations. And, uh, and I'll also have my email address as usual. So if you have any questions, uh, we can communicate. So I hope you can join me for some of them, especially for the ones that are, that are out of town uh, at some of these state parks, especially. But uh, we'll be talking about it more. So, okay, guys, I will have a video, as usual, on Wednesday morning.